I have different rifles and shotguns for a long time, but this time I have purchased something in the middle – semi-shotgun, semi-rifle. This odd weapon is the child of original Russian laws – TR-9. This whole video is about the new rifle and all new 345 TK caliber. Wait, what? What's this? This is the intro. Unpacking. I have never done that before, but now I will. This half rifle, warp in polythene and covered in oil. It is done for long preserving the gun. But as I know, now all the rifles have been sold. Let's get rid of the cover. Gun passport, reminding that is a paradox style rifling. One more package with single magazine, oil can and little toolbox. It's one Russian traditional AK toolbox. I guess it's a ramrod. Yes, exactly, short one. By the way, I have noticed something. It is interesting. Short ramrod and also thick one. I am not sure if it's connected directly to the problem. But in the past there was a problem with another strange caliber, 366. Sometimes bullets stick in barrels. If it happens again with 345 caliber, it's nice ramrod to fix the problem. Kalashnikov recommends use specific ammo with 9 and 5 grams bullet, only that round guarantee proper functioning the carbine. TR-9 actually is 99% Saiga-9 and it's compatible with other parts from Kalashnikov and aftermarket accessories. It comes with one magazine and the magazine is the same like Saiga-9 or Vitez submachine gun magazines. You can easily switch between one and another. Let's check it right now. Most popular magazines here, one is from Legalny Arsenal and another from Pavgan. And let's try it. Ok, no problem. And another one. Yeah, great. It releases freely. But I had to polish it a little bit. Inside the magazine there is a road, which limits capacity by only 10 rounds, according to regulations. By Russian gun laws, for civilian market, available only 10 rounds magazines. But in case you're an official competitive shooter, there is no any capacity limits for you. So, be aware do not remove the road from magazines if you are not a competitor. Be responsible. Let's make quick test for compatibility of the market accessories. Now, Fels gas tube fits perfectly, red dot sight, heavy muzzle brake. When I finish whole customization process, this carabine would look like this. Not only great looking gun, but also the gun with nice ergonomic and functionality. All the best possible features are here. By the way, all parts comes from our online shop pschannel.ru. Buy custom parts on the website and support our channel. It would be great to install all that parts to my new TR9 carbine. <coughs> Whoa, in Russia when someone sneezes, it's portent of truth or I have corona. <coughs> Few words about new caliber 345 TK. These cartridges was designed to be a copy of Luger 9 by 19. Similar weight, similar power factor, similar speed and ballistics. Russian production company Tech Cream tried create new caliber with old characteristics. If they succeed or not, we will find out pretty soon. Bullet has a bit smaller diameter than Luger, but the length of the cartridge case is longer. It's 21 millimeters. Why they invent a bicycle another time? All because of gun laws. In Russia initially you can buy only shotguns, or how it says in the book, long smooth barrel guns. It takes five years until you obtain right to get a rifle.
Для тех, кто не знает, это those who never heard anything about paradox. This is a special kind of rifling in the end of the barrel. The barrel itself is smooth, but last few centimeters has rifling. Once again, legally, it is still smooth barrel gun, but but becomes a little bit a rifle, but technically is a shotgun. Let's call it game of laws. Some people may ask, if it's possible to use cheap Luger with TR-9. First of all, it is illegal. Second, it may cause damage to your gun. So, just like it says, don't try this at home, kids. On the one hand, it gives you an opportunity to participate pistol caliber rifle matches at once. You don't have to wait for five years here in our country. On the other hand, you don't have to start your shooting experience from heavy and strong recoil shotguns, especially for women. If I could, I would prefer to start with TR9. I found here some obvious advantages. Firstly, I can shoot indoor with it. Don't need to make a long way to shooting ranges. Even without traffic jams, it takes two hours in the car. Besides, the heavy 12-gauge recoil is a challenge for girls. In the very beginning, I got bruises for weeks on my shoulder. Meanwhile, with 335 TK, you don't have to think about pain or stress, you can enjoy shooting by itself. That's very important for beginners. But what is most important for me is participation in PCC matches. In our region, shooting ranges are really far. The possibility to train indoor is very good point to buy this gun for beginners. Pricing. According to my data, 345 TK three times more expensive than Luger. That is not a surprise. We have only one factory in the world that produces that ammo. Obviously, it is not a mass production, and it's very hard to expect lower price tag. Probably the only way to get cheaper ammo is reloading. Current price for TR9 is 45,000 rubles, or 630 US dollars, which is the same price for Saiga 9 in 9x19. There were some issues with Saiga 9 initially, but with time all small and big downsides were cleared. Well, as far as TR9 actually is Saiga 9, all that issues left behind. At least I hope so. By the time I bought this gun, all the TRs were sold out. Well, in the near future we will test this carbine. We'll try different 345 caliber rounds and check how accurate at the long range this half shotgun, half rifle.